Here's hoping you'll never have to use it. But if you do get a flat tire, knowing how to use your tire service kit repair system will get you back on the road quickly and safely. A quick note though, for more detailed information, including where the tire service kit is stored on your vehicle, refer to your owner's information. Remember that roadside assistance may be available. Consult your owner's information for details. If you do experience a flat tire, pull over to a safe location and turn on your hazard lights. Position the tire that needs inflating so that the valve stem is located near the ground. This will allow the tire service kit hose to reach the valve stem with the tire service kit flat on the ground. Place the transmission in park for automatic transmission vehicles or in gear for manual transmissions, turn off the ignition and set the parking brake. Place the tire service kit on the ground next to the flat tire. Now screw the clear flexible filling tube to the tire valve. Insert the power plug into the vehicle's power outlet socket. Start the vehicle engine. Push the tire service kit power button to the I position. The electric compressor will be turned on and sealant and air will inflate the tire. Minimum 26 PSI, 1.8 bar of pressure should be reached within 20 minutes. If the pressure has not been reached, turn off and remove the tire service kit. Drive the vehicle 30 feet, 10 meters back and forth to better distribute the sealant inside the tire. Attach the clear flexible filling tube of the compressor directly to the tire valve and repeat the inflation process. When the correct pressure has been reached, start driving the vehicle to uniformly distribute the sealant inside the tire. After 10 minutes, stop and check the tire pressure. If the pressure is below 19 PSI, 1.3 bar, do not drive the vehicle as the tire is too damaged. Contact the nearest authorized dealer. If the pressure is at 19 PSI, 1.3 bar or above, repeat the inflation process to reach the correct tire pressure and continue driving. Peel off the warning label from the bottle and place it on the dashboard as a reminder to the driver that the tire has been treated with the tire service kit. Replace the sealant canister prior to the expiration date at your authorized dealer. This video is not intended to take the place of your owner's manual. For complete details and other important safety information, please see your owner's information.